Hey yo everybody, welcome back to Super Punch Out! I'm Freddy this Charles and we're going to be doing the special circuit in this video, so let's begin. Special circuit number three Narcissus Prince. I will not let you touch my beautiful, beautiful face. From the UK. So I was just thinking, there's an interesting. Oh, and before I start, oh boy, I'm probably gonna lose a couple of times because these guys have really strange patterns. As you can see, he's just twirling around the place. Block, block, block. Punch to the face. This guy can't take punches to the face. Anyway, what I want to say is that these guys are pretty tough. So I might lose a bit. I want to apologize if that happens, but. Like, it doesn't... Yeah. But, yeah, that's... I don't know what else to say, like... Sorry, guys. Come on, it's like the last level of this thing. I'm not really great at this game, as you can see. Take a punch to the face. So, anyway, I did at one point want to point out that I noticed an interesting pattern here with the circuits. So with the minor circuit, you've got these really weakling dudes, like we've got like an old guy, some big lumberjack or whatever, some guy that never made it to champion, oh boy. Ah. Yeah, and some Turkish dude. In the second one we have a whole bunch of stereotypes, like do I need to go over it? Sorry, lost my train of thought there. This guy is just pretty tough, and I don't want to lose to him. Take that. So yeah, second circuit, we have a bunch of stereotypes. Third circuit, we have what I think is a bunch of, um, how do I say this politically correctly? They have different sexual orientations, like... Aaron Ryan full on hugs you, like, come on. Uh, we got Heike Kageros, like a cross dresser, and who's the other guy? Mad Clown. Mad Clown's just. Clowns wear a lot of makeup, but he's wearing makeup. Like, that's the closest thing I can come up with for him. Um, then we've got Super Macho Man, full glorified Metro dude. Even though Metro has nothing to do with it really well. That's the end of Nostis Prince, at least. Smashed his butt. Thank goodness, because I usually when I do the special circuit after not playing for a while, I don't usually beat him. This guy, Hoi Koalo, number two. He is nuts. Please take it easy on a poor old man. Okay, he comes into the ring with a walking stick. Jumps all over the place like a bloody ninja. And smacks you with it. If I'm ever going to lose at some point in the circuit, it's gonna be here. And the worst thing about it is when you hit him, he moves left and right, so you have to change your punches in accordance to where he moves to. Oh, snap. No, you don't. Come on, that was so easy to block. Here we go. Ah. Okay. What I was trying to do there is something I saw in a speedrun. Um, basically, you can do a right uppercut. A right jab, sorry. A right upper jab while he's jumping around and you'll be able to hit him, but... I don't really know the timing for it, so I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to dodge his moves, and I duck here. Okay. Okay, take this. Now that you're done with your fancy footwork, you can kindly get knocked out. Up on the count of four. He's like 74 or something. What did the information say? I'm just gonna cheese him now. 
I really could not be bothered losing at this part. Badly now. Oh, snap. There's no way he's going to win. I just gotta keep dodging. Is that a TK here? Yep. Koi Kolo is down. Yeah, way too close. Oh, that's Koi Kolo. Thank you so much for watching. Tune in next time for the final two fighters in the whole game. See ya.